Hello there, Legionnaires, and welcome back to another isolation episode of Attila Total War, playing as the Saxons. And I hope you're all doing well and surviving this uh, quarantine time, if you're in quarantine, and you're all, all doing well and staying healthy. That is the main thing, whether in isolation or not. But anyway, we are going to continue our Saxon campaign, and in the last episode, we basically put down a load of rebellions and... Uh, which were coming up here in like northern Gaul and Belgium. And we also had a little bit of a, a fight here with the Romans. We took out one of their legions. They're now down to only one legion in this area, but they still have another two over here. And they may have more, because I think the, if we quickly look, the Western Roman Empire is still number one ranking in the world. In the world? Well, in this part of the world anyway. Um, so we need, to, we need to sort that out eventually. We made peace with the Franks, which is okay. I'm fine with that. I may... Make a strike down from Abursus to try and take August of Indecorum if they weaken this area. Um, I'll see. I would also like to go for Argentorum if they if I get a chance. I'd like to sort out the situation here as well in Belgica. It's not really optimal right now, but we will sort that out as and when. Um, again, same over here uh, in this region. Um, I'll move out in three turns because I still have a decent garrison then and the rebel army can't really be a problem and then I can march on uh, Lugdunum which is down here which is what I'll do so we'll end the turn anyway um, no we won't, we've got some skills that need to be handed out so we have a governor here um, no, there's nothing really there I really want to give him I will give you instead authority which will give you more public order yes, and then I'll give you more food I think and Senrid, you're also a governor. You can also have... Hmm, there's nothing there. That's all um, army, I guess. Well, we kind of need to go down if we want to. Um, we could give you something here, though. Tax rate. Public order. That's actually good. Artist, have that. Then you can have that public order as well. There you go. You're going to be well and truly sorted. Senrid, oh, you got another skill. Okay, have that one then. And that just saw everything generally out there, there now, so that's good. Um, and now we'll end the turn. And now we'll see what happens. So hopefully uh, you guys have been enjoying this Let's Play. I do um, appreciate all the support that I'm getting on the channel at the moment. All the subs, all the likes, and comments. Keep it up, guys. Um, really do appreciate it. It's really helping um, build this channel up and taking it places. And that's what I like to see. It's what I've always wanted to do. And can't do it without you guys, so... Thank you very much. And as the Geats move about three full stacks through my lands. Jeez. And another... Th they have a lot of armies. How have they got so much money? It'd be funny if someone went up there and just destroyed their settlement now, wouldn't it? And then they'd have armies that were starving. Because they definitely couldn't feed all those armies. Peace, wow, that is a very men. luxurious... Look at this. He's called Maria. I don't believe for one second you're called Maria. And you're 29. You look older than 29. Maria with a mustache as well. That's one good looking woman apparently. <laughs> um, but no, we'll go with... We're not going to go with that. I can get more money. I could get more money out of you. I also want more land. I don't need your money. I'm making like 5,000 a turn. That's just really a turn's worth of income for me. What you're offering. I want more land. More cities. Uh, mercenary demand, mercenary negotiations, ah, extra cost for mercenaries. Well, I don't really use mercenaries, um, so that's fine. Um, growth, that could be pretty handy. Bailiffs. Um, hmm. Oh, no, it's going to go with this one, because I wanted to get Nordic Levy um, replaced with Nordic Spears. That's right. Okay, so we'll do that. Um, you're supposed to be going into that city there. Um, and then sanitation, we could do that. It certainly helps with growth. That would be really helpful. What's our growth looking like? It's not looking great. Um, it's going to cost a lot to change all these, so there's not really anything. Britain, is there anything in Britain? We could upgrade this, make this, uh, well, better, I guess. Or we could, hmm. Oh, we actually have a lot of stuff we could do over here. You're going up plus five anyway. Um... Could we convert that? No, we couldn't. It would cost a little bit more. 
Yeah, let's see if we can get a little bit of money out of someone. We might convert that as well while we're here. Sit, friend, and let us talk. No, and we've let's... got everything with you, Rugians. We're not. We will glad to listen to your offers. Ah, hi. There we go. Do not wrap them in lies. The spirit snow. We have five you offer that much? Well, I would like a little bit more. Let's make it a thousand. A thousand, and you have a deal. Actually, so, a thousand five hundred. Be quiet, please. I'm trying to do a deal here. There we go. Well, 1,500. That wasn't too hard, was it now? So we'll convert Lindum, the place I currently live. This is Lincoln. Uh, to something else. There we go. Well, basically to uh, my culture's a tort. We're conver converting it to a tort. There we go. Finally get the words out. Um, right. And then I've got a bit of money left. I could... Probably build something else. If I had a little bit more money. Let's try and do a little bit more expensive diplomacy then. Um, the Vendians possibly? Greetings, friend. They take trade as well. We could get a lot of trade going here. And, ha, oh. ripe women to ease other parts. Lots of money. Wow. How much money do you have? There we go. Thank you very much. I'll take all that money off your hands. Um, Lindum... Hmm, food's not actually doing so great. I'm going to put a stores in. Actually, no. If we want food, then, sure we want to go down here. Which one's going to give us the most food? It looks like a goat herd again. I will take your goat herd. Because we already have uh, pastures here. So we already have the Saxon, um, like, mounted chappies. We could get lancers. Ooh. I'm supposed to be getting lancers somewhere else as well. Is it back in Tully it, it. Oh, no, it's not. A Bursis, we're getting uh, lancers. They could be pretty handy. I would like to get some lancers. I'd prefer to have them over these guys, but I bet they're really expensive. Hmm. What can I produce here? Nothing just yet. Hmm. Let's put in that in a Borokum as well, then. I'm going to end the turn again. I'm not really moving any armies just yet because, well, I'm kind of happy with where they all are. It's when that first city gets done. Oh, yep, sure. I'll take that 1,000 off you for a non-aggression pack. Thank you very much. I just like that the Franks have got this navy out here and they're a landlocked nation now. It's just forever going to be the... Give me a little bit of a, a smile. Geats just have so much to move. Hopefully we don't see the Huns anytime soon yet. Don't really want to get on their bad side. I don't want to make peace with the Huns, uh, make peace with the Western Roman Empire, because that won't be good for my relationship with the Huns, because they're probably at war with them at this point. Could do with carrying on taking some more land. It looks like... This region here is going to be lost, uh, Aquitania, which is fine, because I'm kind of just going to try and spear all the way through to um, Italy at this point. Germania has a growth. Um, has had growth. There we go. Had a gro had a growth. Uh, <laughs> it's just it's just a bit of Germania. It's just grown out of nowhere. Um, I think I'll go with a. What's the public order like if you leave this region? Plus one. Not great then. Go with the town centre. Town centre will be good. Um, Can you reach? You can. But you can reach there as well. So we actually don't need to keep both these armies around. Just yet. Unless they have a siege equipment. But I don't know where I sent this army. Hmm. Right. I don't know. Ooh. Nordic Spearmen. Yes, of course. We have our Nordic Spears now. I have no none of them in this army. I have none here either. Where do all my Nordic Spears go? Oh, here. I don't actually have many levies left, it would seem. And they're fairly good now, actually. Um... Gaul emerges as well, okay. All the way down here, okay, in a looser. Non-aggression. And nothing else really needs to be done. I will just do my tech while I think about where I want to move those armies. 
Um, could do a town and a city. It would help with growth. Wealth from cultural buildings. Commerce for 11. Mm. Industrial, I think. We'll go with industrial. Six turns on that. 7,000 now a turn. We are raking in the cash. Oh, and we can upgrade you. Uh, to the Nordic Horse Raiders. Yeah, sure. Let's do it. They're not actually too expensive. We're That's not a treasure. Oh, we do have some spears here that need upgrading. Yeah, sure. Have them. Have them. Okay, we're a bit lower than uh, our money before. We can actually start moving out. There we go. Start moving out. How much is that going to... 18. Jeez. Now might be the time to also bring in a... Ah, see, if we get London, London, we need to uh, start promoting Germanic paganism, really. Like, hard. Um, squalor would be, like, through the roof here. I imagine... Mm, this is actually doesn't promote it at all, either. I'm going to put a fleet in. Actually, do I want a fleet? Eh, yeah, I guess we could have a fleet. Tax rate, govern province. No, so not you, then. Mentor. I'll put the sage guy in. Raise a fleet. We'll buy a, ourselves a little fleet. He can defend there. Um, have some bows, ships, just to guard you, I guess. And then that can be used to guard the channel. Um, we could convert this. No, we can't. Not enough money. Hmm. I'm going to put the troughs in there, help with sanitation and growth. And then, what else? Got uh, 1,900 left. Hmm. I guess I could build this army up. I don't really need to keep it in Britain anymore. Britain seems like it's... Gradually getting happier. Gradually. Germanic paganism's not doing so well, though. Not doing so well at all. Uh, what could we build here? We could build more spears. Don't really need them. I'll build another Nordic Brigade. And I'll build... Some more spears. And I'll make it a 10 stack for now. It's just... Oh, I don't know. It's just tough. What do I want to build? I guess I just can... Upgrade all these Nordic Cav. Make these better. It's going to bring down my amount of money that I bring in a turn a lot, but who cares? I probably should. Um, I just can't... Rome just got like a full-on wall of legions here. And I don't think I have the strength to take them both out. I could... Ooh, actually, that's a point. I could possibly... I'll attack this... Yeah, as I thought. Didn't think I had much of a chance. Then if I put the other one under seat in here as well. That's not too bad. We'll we'll take that. We'll put that under siege for a bit. Ah, of course. I should really upgrade this army. Give this a better garrison. Really. Um, so I don't really need so many troops over here, actually. I'll have your troops back. Take your troop back. I'll take give put it in his troop. There we go. Perfect, right, so that'll sort that out. You now have a garrison that can deal with that. First, actually, move to here. Mmm, that's annoying. You're not going to rebel just yet, but it's going to be close. Hmm. Ron Tomagus is pretty well defended now. It's not going to be a problem if it rebels. It's these two. Oh, it's always a problem. Oh, I hate, I hate just trying to convert everything. I should burn stuff. I should try and just burn stuff. Or convert religion. One or the other. Here come the Franks with their little boats again. Geats, just come and help you. I know you're at war with the Western Roman Empire. You have, like, thousands of men now. Thousands of men available. And you're wasting them just sitting in the sea. Ah, here we go. I thought this might be the case, so I'll flee. 
And see if the other... Yeah, I'll flee with this army. And this army's gonna come and take me out. Ooh. Jeez, look at the stacks that they have. It's gonna be tough, but I think we can win this. They have a lot of Western Palatina. Just need to take some generals out. I have my better cav, but we'll see. I'll fight this on the battlefield, and we'll see if we can win this. It's going to be a rough one. So I'll see you guys on the battlefield in a moment. Okay, so we are back on the battlefield, and the plan is to probably stand on this corner up here. Not, not quite a corner, but we're going to go onto this high ground over here. And we're going to uh, use the high ground against the Romans, and basically, hopefully win like so. So we'll attack, we're going to put all our troops, like, that, I think. And then we're going to... I'm so glad that we got a better uh, spears now. I'll see how good these Nordic spears are actually are in combat. I'm going to put the swords on the left flank. My general can go over here. Cavalry can go on the right flank. And we will see what happens. I'm going to speed this up just for sakes of the... Uh, of the video. Alright, that's fine. I'm sure the enemy has been spotted. They've got a pretty scary army. Yeah, these are all high threat, these Western Palatina. They are goddamn awful. But I'm going to focus down their general, and then we hopefully a lot of them will break. And then we'll do the same with the next army. And they've only got one mer they've only got one mercenary Germanic hurler. I'm not too scared of that. Oh, okay. They're just here, apparently. That's a thing. Did not steal this. Uh, this, this could work. Can let's just move everything back. Cavalry. I did not realize they were coming behind us. Oh, we've lost a Nordic flipping brigade already. I mean, they were going to be no use if it, they couldn't stand up a cavalry charge. They weren't going to stand to mercy. Um, Palatina Guard, or Palatina, whatever they're called. Rally. Go up there, kill them. How rude are these guys? Oh, apparently I will probably break these Palatina Guard with my cavalry. Wow, I did not realize they were that good. Uh, archers, pull back. Not a fan of you just standing here. Where's the other cavalry unit? Can you get these guys, please? I do apologize for how goddamn awful the, the uh, map is. I don't really like this. I can barely see what's going on. Can we have some spears going in here? God, this is awful. I can barely see what's going on. And where's the other Roman army? Oh, it's so close! Let's just turn everyone around. Archers, get a heck out of there. Never healthy for archers to be in combat. Units. 
Let's get every spear unit just for the sake of the uh, like sake of being able to see. Let's get them out of here. Archers, can you move? You're supposed to move when you're, uh, you know, like under threat. Lees were holding most of the Roman army up with about three units. Go up here. Go up here. Go up here. Come on. Where's their general? He's all the way back here. Shoot the general. You guys shoot them. You guys shoot them. Where are they running for their lives? Oh, no, over here. Not great. Not great. Former shield wall. Cavalry, you're needed over here. Battle ready and, eager. and there they go. They're all breaking. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Right, we've beaten that first army. Now we've got to deal with this army. It's going to be hard. An entire unit has perished. It's going to be hard. Can you all come over here? Can you start just like shooting some of these guys? Is there Saxon spears in here? No. Apparently not. Okay, right. Cavalry, get around here. Oh no, that's general. Archers start shooting. Start breaking them. Shoot all these guys. Uh, keep coming around here. Come on, you can break. Come on, guys. Take these guys out, then. Come on. That's just stupid. They had no cavalry left when I last checked. Right, cavalry here. Right, where's that general? We've got to hold him up. Just keep shooting those guys over there, please. Right, perfect. We've broken them there. Take those slingers out. Oh, we're doing okay. We're doing okay. The enemy general is dead. Excellent. The enemy general is dead? I didn't even think that. Oh, God. I did not think we were going to win this. But I think that might, that might clinch it. Where's our general? Send a rally up. Get in there. Get in there. You take them out. Uh, why are you in combat, cavalry? Get them out, cavalry. Combat. Oh, God damn it. Why are you still over here? Can you stop being on skirmish mode down? Can you just go and take these guys out, please? The rest of you guys, just get off skirmish mode as well. You can probably take these guys out. Take these guys out. Come on. Get out of combat. Just run these guys down. Finish them off. We're breaking these guys. The Nordics chaps might break, but we're holding them off everywhere else. Okay. So that's the Nordic swords. That's fine. There, it's expected. That was expected. Right. Get these cavalry out of combat. Don't want them being engaged by spears. This is going to be huge. If we can keep the cavalry alive. Apparently, we don't have a chance. I, on the other hand, think we might have a chance. 
Oh, we've lost that fight there. Oh, that's not so good. Right, we brought those, broke those guys there. Spears, you need to get in behind. Support your general. The Nordic Brigade's back. Good, good. We're going to need every man. Oh, no. Get off melee. Um, you should have a skirmish on now because you have problems with cavalry. You don't have problems with cavalry, sorry. Um, oh, it's not looking good. It's not going to be enough. We're just about breaking. You've used all your ammo. You get in there. Oh, how did, oh they got trapped by those goddamn bastards. Okay. All right, get in here. Slingers. Thing is, we're beating all these guys decisively. We're beating all of this decisively. Riley. Come on. Most of this stuff needs to break. Get as close as you need to and break these guys. Come on, General. Get in here. Fight. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Right. Well, not, not the fleeing bit. Oh, it's going to be so close. I don't know how we're... The numbers just... Yeah, okay. The numbers of... Ah... Uh... It's frustrating, frustrating. Oh, uh, it looks like it's going to be a defeat. But it was a worthy defeat. Like, look at how many men we've taken out of this Roman army. And I can replace this army. Probably better troops now. The enemy has killed our general. Yeah. Uh, there's our general gone. I think that was Hengist or something like that. That's annoying. That is, that is unfortunate. I will. That was a valiant defeat, but yeah, Hengist is gone. That is a shame. But you, look how many men we took out. Like Hengist himself took out nearly 250. Cav got 421. Jeez, that Cav's good. We need to get more of that Cav. This ca we need to make more Cav-based armies. Nordic Brigade are just not worth it now. Apparently, they've like lost no men. <laughs> fall back. Yep, yeah, definitely a fall back. Um, right there, just gonna let us survive. That's fine. Non-aggression with the Rugins. Uh, yes, I will take that. I will take your non-aggression. I don't know how this army got all the way down here. This is... Oh, this is the um, army that was coming from Rontomagus. Ah. That is unfortunate. Well, that is annoying, but we can now probably put uh, Osmond... Uh, not Osmond. We'll put this guy, Elthma, the fearless warrior, in to replace him. Belgica is going to rebel. Lungdunensis will rebel. Secret meetings, not so good. You go back to Rontomagus. Go and do your thing. Um, I'd like you to get that so you can get some pikes for me. These Nordic Spears weren't terrible, but they're not brilliant. Cavalry is a bit too expensive. Um, get some more mercenary Saxon spears as well. I should get all of these. That's fine. Um, you. Uh, oh, let's sort this out. Let's. Uh, secret meetings. Kill them anyway. Yes, kill them all. Ha you become an elder. Horsa? You can also become an elder. Why not? And you can become a warlord all the way up there, chappy. You get in there, so that's going to help this out, but it's not going to make a difference. For the tribe. Um, hmm. You're not a full stack. I actually probably could take that army out. I'm going to move this army all the way up to Colonial Agrippia because Augustus Dvorum can hold itself just about if a... Well, it can hold itself for one turn if a revolt comes up. I'm going to attack that. Because I'm thinking I can win this. So we're going to fight this battle as well. And we will see what happens in this scenario. I think, well, we can probably take out 
Most of their stuff with those heavy axes that we've got. We've got more cav. Actually, no, we've got similar sort of cav to them. But I'm going to use my cav more defensively this time because they brought, like, Hunnic stuff. So that's not okay. This army needs taken out. And then we could possibly take uh, Argentatorum with this army if it's not too beaten up. We'll see. We will see. All in the snow. We're going to have a snowy battle today. Excellent. Right. So we're going to face them off. We're, we've got to attack them this time, which is fine. Um, put our... Yeah, keep our slingers out front. Have our... Spears. Like so. Have swords on the flanks. Though these guys are pretty trash and need phasing out of our army. Axe warband. Best way to phase them out. Get them killed. And we'll have all the cav, I think, on this flank. Actually, no. Let's put the mounted warband on this flank. Yeah, that's fine. Move the line up. We have the balance of power in our favor this time, but only just. And Rome's goddamn tough anyway. I mean, most of his units are actually made up of, like, step warband and other stuff. He's got a lot of legio. Bit of a problem. But I outnumber him in archers. And these guys are skirmishers, so they're even worse. So that's fine. We'll just speed this up for the sake of it. See whether Rome responds in a minute. Probably not. He's got Scout Equites. They're a bit annoying. And Mercy Step Raiders. These are probably the most scary unit you can bring. They're apparently they're low threat to everything I have. Wow. Seriously? Wow. They're like one of the nasty units I find as the Huns, but okay. Is everything... Everything's just about where it needs to be. Carry on moving up, then. As you were, boys. Uh, oh, cavalry. Move to about there. So, yes. Yeah, so unfortunately, we had a setback with the first attack. But now we're... Well, we didn't attack the first battle. But now we're going to take the offensive. They're taking out one of our armies. We'll take out one of theirs. Bit of a tit for tat almost. Uh, don't know why you're falling back, pal. Send an audit brigade to go and help. Uh, oh, they got the better charge there. But that's fine. We can send in some audit brigade again to go and support. Hopefully our missiles, yeah, our missiles are winning that fight nicely. Um, and there you go. There you go, the cavalry. Even Nordic Brigade have a purpose. Ca taking out cavalry, that's fine. As long as they don't get charged by cavalry, they're okay. Um, spears. Start to form yourselves a shield wall. Who won that fight then? We won that fight, perfect. Go and take out them. Good, good, good. Right. Uh, don't know why you're fleeing. No need for you to flee. Go and hold in the. Go and help support that line. Right. We won that fight over there as well. Yeah. This is going to be an easy, an easy win in comparison to some of the other one. That last battle. Mountain Warband didn't fare awful either. Um. Can you guys just start? Shooting everything back here. There's like, there's no need for you to be on skirmish mode now. That's fine. They can take out, try and take out our general. He's gonna form shield wall and he's gonna look just lovely. He's gonna look just lovely, right? The enemy have rallied their units. They've rallied units. Uh, okay. You do you. You rally some units. Um. Oh, Nordic, go in there. I don't need you here. See if the general comes to my cavalry, that'd be fine. Yeah, we've got this nicely wrapped up. I'm going to just send my general in there. Oh, no. Not you. Uh, oh, no, we got you. Send you in first. Yeah, my axe. These axes do work. 
Start shooting uh, the general as well. Cavalry, go and deal with the archers. Excellent, there we go. We've broken all this Roman rubbish. Mainly because it's not most of it's not Roman. And I'm gonna make sure it all dies this time. God damn it, they're all, it's all dying this time. Um archers all shoot the goddamn general. Uh everyone chase start chasing stuff down. General, you can join in the chasing down. Actually, all spears. Just gonna move on to start chasing stuff down. Like, you just just kill everything. Oh, run. Just the general left. Oh, I do apologize. Just bash my mic as I'm nearly about to sneeze. Hopefully, I've not got any diseases. Big unlucks if I do at this point. Do not want any any disease at this point. Make yourself paranoid as hell. Worried that it's uh, the dreaded one. Uh, they're just going to break, apparently. Uh, okay, then you just... One, one big charge from you. That'll do the job. Excellent. Watch these guys run them down. Uh, archers, you can hold your fire now. Just just come chase these guys down. Yep, yeah, that's fine. Enemy general can be murdered. I don't think much of the army is going to get away. Much, if any. Nice. Excellent. We've got these guys basically on the run. Kill these guys. Kill these guys. And um, we'll just speed this up for the sake of it. There you go. All sped up. I don't know how many are left in this general unit. Not many. Jeez. They are getting absolutely rinsed. Very nice. There we go. Revenge for the battle that we just had. Rome, uh, Western Romans may be taking out one of my armies, but I'm nearly replenishing the army anyway. And they've lost the 17 stack here. Excellent. There we go. That'll do. Decisive victory. That is fine. I can take that. I barely lost anything. I could probably actually now go and push on an Argentacorum. And I will. I'm going to take that city for myself. God damn it. Those men doing so much damage to my uh, first army. Yeah, there you go. That's an, that's an army gone for them. That's what we like to see, and then we'll take some uh, we'll take some Romans that want to join the Saxon lines. There we go, Argentacorum. I'll just stab him in the chest. Nothing ever happened. Hopefully, we didn't lose too many men. Could have been worse, I guess. Uh, just occupy. Just occupy. Uh, knock everything down here. Do not want any of this rubbish. Actually, can we convert one of these? Uh, Steel for ooh, steel forge. What does that get? Six hundred in industry, Nordic. Uh, axe warriors. Yeah, that actually might be kind of handy. Does damage the public order a lot though. Only problem. Only problem. Um, yeah, I'll see if I can find the money. Is that what we've got over here then? Steel forge. Ah, yes, we have, but we haven't got quite got it yet. Um, I'm going to carry on knocking it down, then I might convert it to someone else. Knocking down gets you more money. Oh, yeah, they had, like, some really weird... They had Matiari. They had, like, some pretty leveled-up stuff then. Um, yeah, I'm not too fussed about the rest of that. We've got all our archers there. We just need the cab back. Um, okay, yeah, so now we've secured that. So, of course, the Trevorum never needs defending again. It's just those two in front of it. Um, I'm gonna go with more morale versus Romans, and then and then attrition suffered from uh, snow, and then we can make him immune to snow. Ooh, that could be kind of handy. Um, you can take morale, and you can also have what would zeal do? Integrity. That's pretty handy. I'm gonna take cavalry battle movement speed. That's even better. But anyway, guys, that's probably where we're going to wrap up this episode. I hope you guys have enjoyed. We had two epic battles in that one. One we did lose, but only just. And the other one we won decisively. 
crushing a Roman legion and really opening up this whole area. First, it was like a solid wall of settlements. Now, I can see holes that we can go through. We can go for Vindelacorum. If we wanted to, we could go for Visontio. Probably we'll go for Visontio first. Um, but yeah, we've really uh, opened things up here. We've got lots of armies ready to uh, strike. I might be able to bring over the army from England soon if we can sort out public order here. If it ever gets sorted out. Um, have we got any... Oh, we still got money we could spend if we wanted to. Uh, there's nothing really I want to spend it on. Might save it. Save it and we can then upgrade one of our settlements next turn and convert it to the real uh, Germanic side. Actually, that's a point. We'll quickly look. Uh, Germanic Pagan is still going up. That's fine. But anyway, guys, like I said, if you've enjoyed them, please do leave a like, subscribe, and a comment. Does appreciate. I appreciate all the support. And until next time, Legionnaires...